well, we just had a, a whoop from a place where there's no way there's people down there. And it sounded like a people, but we know there's no people down there. So it's, the, it's got to be the forest people because there, there's no trails down there. It's just what you're seeing in front of you for like five miles going downhill. And it's so steep and so crazy. The only thing that could be down there is Squatch. We're at the edge as far as we'll go. We can't go any further down because it's getting dark. Now, we were playing around before, and she totally got some whoops. She got two or three whoops back. First, I heard it go, and then I heard a couple whoops. I heard a whistle. There was a whistle. There was a knock. That was a knock. It's Squatch. I told you it was Squatch. I told you. Good job, honey. Emmy's pretty good at calling them. Whenever she does her thing, they pretty much answer back. Huh. Have to admit it. So I've got two whoops, a knock, and some chatter from Emmy's whooping around up here on the top of the ridge. Now that was a bird. We got, about, we got about two miles or three miles to walk back, so the sun is going down. Congratulations, Emily, on a successful call and response session. Nice job. There it is. Got it on film, yes. Just as good as finding Bigfoot. <laughs> Did you hear that, Bobo? Awesome. Awesome little series. We gotta hike down some big cliffs next to those waterfalls. Whoa, did you hear that? We just heard a rah over in the distance. Better microphones. Was a whoop. There's a whoop. whoop. That's a back whoop. human energy down there.
It's pretty, uh, it's pretty desolate. We got a long walk back. But it's pretty nice to walk, oh, did you hear that? It's pretty nice to walk all the way the heck out here into the forest. Have Emily make a few calls and now, now we got endless. It seems unbelievable. But we're on patrol. Tree peekers. <laughs>